Another good ball. All right. Three really, really good. Okay, folks, what's going on? Doc Blade, Forensic Golf. So, yeah, working with technology, right? Hey, before we talk about this, do me a favor, folks. Hit that subscribe button if you haven't already subscribed because it makes a world of difference. As you can see, we're already adding a lot of technology and a lot of other things to the golf channel. And that's all because of the subscriptions numbers have gone up and enabled us to do some more things that create some more collaboration versus competition. Also, check out the playlist there's a ton of videos in there and it's very consistent over the years i don't jump around my goal is to get you playing better golf but again all right here we go so we was in the studio working on a premium setup measuring it managing it and then measuring it again with technology and once i looked at my numbers i said hey i was averaging only three to five yards off the target line and some people may say, hey, that's nothing. That's a great shot. But if you're going to go through the time and go ahead and measure it, why not try to correct it? When I found out I need to take a little bit more time in my dress position to make sure my shoulders were correct, okay? So after I piston pivot anchor my weight, I have to make sure my shoulders are a little bit more correct. And that brought my ball within that one to three yards that I like to be in with certain clubs, okay? So now we're going to take them to the golf course. All right, my piston pivot, anchor my weight. And then I'm going to make sure my shoulder line is correct. Good ball. Hit another one. Check my shoulders. Really good ball right there. Another good ball. So now what we're doing, we actually taking the data from the um, instant start the studio and making it work toward the golf course. So we measured. Now what we're doing is called managing and then we'll measure again. All right, so here we go, one more shot. Simple things. Just checking my shoulder lines. Shoulder looks good. Another good ball. All right. Three really, really good balls. One of them was a golf shot. Two of them was very, very good balls, okay? But the reason I was able to make that correction was because I measured it, I managed it, and then I'm going to measure again. I go inside the studio later today or tomorrow and I'll check my shoulder line and I'll measure again. Also me getting the hack motion on me two or three times a week is making not only a difference in me, but it's making a difference in my clients also. Take care folks, don't be afraid to measure, then make sure you get a plan to manage your measurements and then go measure again. That is absolutely the golf journey. You will continually knock off little points on your golf swing and you'll notice you're getting better in different points. And then you can go focus on what you need to really work on. Is it 100 yard shots? Is it bump and runs? Is it putting? Whatever it is. But you have to have sound mechanical skills and then apply it to your imagination, your creativity, and that's what golf's all about. Friends of Golf, checking out folks. Remember, the journey does require work but have a lot of fun while you're doing that work. You know take what, care. folks? I said, hey, let me take you up here. Because, you know, that's one of the things I like doing. I like actually showing the results, you know. And I noticed that a lot of clients enjoy seeing the results. Results. All right. A lot of rain last night, the last two days. So they haven't got to the bunkers. They, just, I just saw my number, number 10 working on the bunkers with three great balls. And it's because I measured managed and measured right that was the last ball i hit which felt the best but it's not the best result and then that was the second ball right here and that was the first one that never left this line right there all three really good balls from 159 yards to the green 
I took an eight iron and it's 48 degrees today. Not bad. Measure, manage, measure again, repeat. Take care.